Hi everyone, it's MJ, and let's play around with this new chat GPT whatever thing. Um, so I don't know, how do we actually do this? Let's just tell it to tell me the path to enlightenment. Enlightenment, is that how you spell enlightenment? It's not even... <laughs> <laughs> not even how you spell enlightenment let's click submit um oh the path to enlightenment is different for everyone but some common practices include meditation mindfulness self-reflection and spiritual exploration additionally reading books on philosophy and spirituality can help to broaden one's understanding of the world and provide insight into the nature of reality ultimately the path Ooh, and then it just kind of ends. Um, wait, can I, like what, can I then ask it something a little bit more, more deeper? What is the goal of humanity? Is that how you spell humanity? Yes, submit. Ooh, the goal of humanity is to create a better world for all people where everyone can live in peace, harmony, and prosperity. This includes creating a society that is equitable and just where everyone has access to basic needs such as food, shelter, education, and healthcare. Additionally, it... Is it cutting off because like <laughs> I have to pay to get like the rest? That, that could be. Maybe I'm only getting two sentences because I have to pay to upgrade. Uh, let's see. Um, is an actuary better than an accountant? Let's see what it says here. Submit. It depends on the individual's goals and interests. An actuary is a professional who specializes in assessing risk and calculating the cost of potential events, such as insurance claim or investments. An accountant is a professional who specializes in managing financial records and preparing financial statements. Both professions require strong analytical skills very diplomatic very you know it's it's not leaning in that that actuaries are better um we can always i mean what is the meaning of life that is such a what is the meaning of life in 2023 let's let's just spice it up a little bit by putting in a date um, <laughs> the meaning of life is like to be the same as it is today. To live a life of purpose, joy, and fulfillment. This could mean different things for different people, but it could involve pursuing meaningful work, cultivating relationships with family and friends, and engaging in activities. Is there a God? Let's see what this thing says from that question. Ooh, the answer to this question is subjective and depends on one's personal beliefs. Some people believe in a higher power or a divine being, while others do not. Ultimately, it is up to each individual to decide what they believe about the existence of God. It's it's too diplomatic. It's it's trying to be. It doesn't have like an opinion. It's just trying to play like the middle, the middle ground. Um, gosh, what what else can we can we ask this thing? I don't have too much time. I need to run run to gym um we've asked it if there's a god we've asked it the meaning of life we've asked it the goal of humanity we've asked it the path to enlightenment we've asked it the main question are actuaries better than accountants um let's ask it that what is the funniest joke in the world let's click submit there is no single funniest joke in the world as human. No, not everything has to be subjective and different people. Look at this. It's, a, it's telling me the same thing. Um, <laughs> what did the fish say when it hit the wall? Damn, what? But look at this. Okay, so in every single question, it is saying we asked it the path to enlightenment. It says it's different for everyone. Okay. Um, when we ask the actuary, I mean, it, it does give the classic actuarial answer of, you know, it depends. Um, and then what, yeah, I mean, yeah, could mean different things for different people. This question is subjective and depends. So subjective and different, or maybe I'm just asking questions that are very subjective. Let's, let's maybe give it a more scientific question. Um, does dark 
matter exist okay now let's hope it doesn't say <laughs> it depends for for different people it does and for other people it doesn't let's see if it gives me something more dark matter is a hypothetical form of matter that is believed to make up most of the universe so while its existence has not been conclusively proven there is strong evidence to suggest that dark matter does exist scientists are continuing to study dark matter in order to understand its properties and how it you have to, I think, pay for, for the upgrade. Um, oh, let's give this. Explain how moment generating functions work. Yeah, this is, this is, you know, you don't need me as a teacher of actuarial science anymore if this thing can, can explain it. Moment generating functions are mathematical functions used to calculate the moments of a probability distribution. They are used to calculate the expected value variance in higher order moments of random variables. They are defined as the expectation of the random variable raised to a power. Okay, so it's just telling me what it is. It's not telling me, you know, how it's a harmonic function and, and all of those kind of things. They're quite magical, these MGFs. Um, let's think of one more question. One, one more question question if you could ask an ai anything anything what would you what would you ask it? let me know in the comment section below or actually just come to this yeah i'll post the website as well and you guys can play around with it um last question i feel like there's, that's a lot of pressure that is a lot of of pressure on this last question um Maybe let's do something, do something fun, do something fun. Um, let's ask it to who was smarter. Or oh, let's ask it, I'm probably not going to misspell his name, so I can't spell when I'm live streaming. Was Frederick ooh, Nietzsche, let me just spell this guy's name properly. Although I kind of think that's like the German, or let's just go with Nietzsche. Um, was Nietzsche right? That's very open-ended because Nietzsche said a lot of crazy things. So let's maybe end off with, with this question. Was Nietzsche right? Oh, I have to click submit. <laughs> the answer to this question depends on one's interpretation of the philosopher Friedrich Nietzsche's work. Nietzsche was a complex th <laughs> thinker who wrote about a wide range of topics, including morality, religion, and the nature of truth. Some people agree with his views, while others disagree. No, it gave the same answer of it's different people have different answers. Okay, cool. Um, that's, yeah, we're playing around with the new chatbot. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you're going to ask it and what its responses were. Uh, as always, thanks for watching. Cheers.